Hey guys, what's happening? Today's video, I'm firing up the Blackstone. Hadn't fired it up since I made my El Reno jalapeno onion burgers. It's been a while. Craving some Philly cheesesteaks. I've got just enough to make a few. I'm gonna do sliders, just because I don't have that much going on. I got some Hawaiian rolls inside. Uh, do a quick little, little grill, just fire it up. Bell pepper, onion, uh, green and red bell pepper, onion. I don't even think I have any provolone cheese. I gotta go check. Um, we'll see. Doctor it up. It's all good. Hope you like the video. All right, guys. So I'm already got up some uh, all veggies cut up, ready to go. As you can see here, just gonna throw them on. Start sauteing them. Turn the grill down. It was pretty hot. Get them going here. Nice. Cooking quick. You know the Blackstone don't take long. All right, guys, so I bought this thin sliced sirloin beef Philly steak meat from my local grocery store, H-E-B. And it's supposed to be pretty good. I've never used it. Thinly sliced sirloin, USDA choice. Uh, instructions call for putting it on the stone or the grill and it cooks really fast. It'll actually break up as you're cooking it. Kind of like with steak, little steak patties, but they're sliced. We'll see. We will see. All I know is I'm hungry. I don't think I had enough vegetables cut up either, but it'll be all right. And by the way, I turned the fire off on this side, cool side over here, very hot on this side, of course, that's that, but I don't know, we'll see, should be pretty good. It's going to sound like foghorn leg horn here and just say, pay attention, son, pay attention here. I said, look at what I'm doing. Trying to kick the heat down a little. Go from there. Give it time, I guess. Just give it a little time. Never used this meat before. It was uh, it was there and couldn't find my butcher, so I just went with this. I don't know. We'll find out, right? Live and learn. Experiment. Right? That's what it's all about. Food experiments. Right, as you can see, it's kind of broken up pretty good. And I don't know, man, just the, the barbecue guy in me needs a little, you know, Suckle Busters SPG. Put a little SPG on there. Just a little. Flavor it up a little bit. Just because. You can see it's kind of Shredded pretty good. It's frozen up that way, I guess. I mean, I don't know. Not look too bad. I 
Let's say I kick the heat down a bit. Turn these veggies around on this other side. I out of camera, but stir them up. That side's turn that side off already. All right, looking good. Looking good. All right, guys. I think this is about ready to. Get make it made, made what we make. Here's what I'm gonna do and how I'm gonna do it. Kind of square it off a little bit. I'm not sure. Try to make it where it fits in that uh, Hawaiian rolls. I'm gonna use. I didn't have any provolone, you know, but it's all right. I guess the uh, Mexican and me, I got some uh, shredded Monterey Jack with jalapeno, mild cheddar. Not authentic, but hey, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. A lot of that cheese on there. Let's see how it comes out. A lot of cheese, a lot of cheese. Cheesy and melty. Goodness. I know, it might be too much, but hey, that's how I like it. And tell you what, Blackstone, 22 inch with the hood. I love it. I'm gonna steam this cheese, put a little water down. Close the hood. Two minutes, not even two minutes, 30 seconds. Count it down. Count it down. That cheese is going to melt. It's so good. Got it. Get my spatula over here in my box. I'm gonna need two of them to put on. All right. Yeah, I see that looks pretty good. What you guys? Zoom in there a little bit. All right. See if I can do this without making a mess. Gonna be interesting. Sorry about the camera movement. Here we go. I'm gonna get a drum roll, please. Oh, yeah. I did it. I did it. That turned off. Off of there. And, uh, close up. Get the top on. Top's on. Oh yeah. I'm gonna slice into these and give them a taste. All right, all plated up. Looks good. Just simple Philly cheesesteak slider with the. Uh, not traditional cheese and some fries. Let's see how it tastes. All right, here it goes. Cheesesteak slider. Not bad. Mmm. 
Not bad. That Monterey um, jalapeno cheese. Got to have a fry. You know that H-E-B frozen Philly meat choice? It's not bad. It's pretty good. I'd definitely buy it again. Not traditional, I know. But good. All right, guys. Thanks for checking it out. Pretty good cheesesteak. Just simple, fast. You know, it didn't take me, what, 10 minutes total? Uh, check it out. Comment below. Let me know what you think. Appreciate comments. Love comments. I know you're listening and paying attention. Uh, appreciate any advice you could give, any recommendations. Uh, yeah, so just let me know. Thanks, guys. Y'all have a good one. See you on the next time.